Uh, this is a follow-up, as you're aware, to the meeting that was held on the 23rd of July in Shillong. And we decided to meet after that meeting today, on 6th of August in Guwahati. We're very happy that um, the meeting was a very constructive, a very positive meeting that we had. We have been very clear from both the governments that we want to resolve the areas of differences and the disputes that are there between the two states. It has been very long and uh, a lot of people have suffered in different uh, areas because of these differences that have existed. Therefore, there is a very strong political will to find an amicable solution to these areas of differences. Number two, we have also agreed that whatever we do, it must be done in a respectful manner and both the states need to respect each other. Today in the meeting, we had a detailed presentation given by the government of Assam on six of the areas of the differences that are there out of 12. The strategy which both the state governments have agreed to follow is to take up these matters in a phase-wise manner. So there are areas which are slightly lesser complicated, some slightly more, and some very complicated. So therefore, we would like to resolve these issues by taking the disputes or the areas of differences in a phase-wise manner. Therefore, we have decided that six areas out of the 12, one, Tarabari, two, Gizang, three, Pahim, four, Boklapara, five, Khanapara, Pilankata, and six, Ratachera. Out of these 12 areas of differences, these six areas is what we have decided that we will move towards finding an amicable solution to these. In the interest of ensuring that it's done in a much faster manner, we have also decided that there will be regional committees that will be formed by both the states, which will be headed by a cabinet minister. So we have three regions where these six areas of differences fall in. So in these three regions, we have three committees from Meghalaya and three committees from Assam, and both will be headed, or I should say both sides will be headed, each committee will be headed by one cabinet minister. And uh, we have decided also that uh, we will focus on, number one, historical facts, number two, ethnicity, number three, administrative convenience, number four, willingness and the overall uh, uh, sense of the people's sentiments, and number five, contiguity. Based on these five uh, areas or uh, these five terms, we will try to find a way forward. And we have urged these committees to submit their reports and their findings after making joint visits uh, to the uh, different areas and locations within the next 30 days. Within these 30 days, the Honorable Chief Minister of Assam and myself will also be making some visits to some of the areas of differences also in order to give a positive message to the people and to show our keenness and willingness to move forward to finding a solution to this very, very important and long-pending difference and dispute that the two states have. So once again, I would like to thank the Honorable Chief Minister of Assam and the Government of Assam for having invited us for this meeting. And I'm very, very positive that with the uh, right political will and with respect for each other and ensuring that the realities of today's uh, world are also taken into consideration, that we will be able to find a solution to these difficult problems that we're facing. Thank you very much.